there's trouble in paradise and only you can help. Victory will be mine! Hi, I'm Rebecca Brayton and welcome to WatchMojo.com and today we'll be checking out Microsoft's Viva Pinata 2. Alas, it appears that the island's rapid growth has also led to the increasing sophistication of one of its few natural predators. Have a look at this shocking amateur video. This is Viva Pinata Trouble in Paradise, which is obviously the sequel to the original Viva Pinata. What's really cool about it is we took all the great stuff from the first one and really amped it up. So you've got a lot more pinatas, a lot bigger gardens, a lot more regions of the world to bring pinatas from. I have discovered sweet new pinata realms ripe for the picking. The polar pinarctic mucho frio. The scorchingly sandy desert desert. And twinkle, twinkle, little star. The goal of the game is really about growing and cultivating these gardens to attract beautiful pinatas to come live there. So you have to plant the right kind of plants, have the right kind of environment, have the right kinds of other pinatas. So you've got a wide range of pinatas. There's over a hundred of them. Everything from like horstachio to the tunicorn and hopefully have them do the romance dance. So the romance dance is when you get a couple of pinatas of the same species in your garden and you build them a house and they decide to get together and start a family. What age group is this game appropriate for? It is actually rated uh, E10, but it is really approachable for uh, a wide range of people. So anybody from kids to adults. But it also has really deep gameplay as you get into sort of managing and growing your garden. The other really cool thing is we've now made it a lot easier for you to share pinatas with your friends. So what you can actually do is if you've customized a pinata that you really like, say you're really into gorilla pinatas, you can customize your pinata, upload it to vivapinata.com, and then your friends can actually download it, or anyone can download it as a card that they can then scan using the live vision cam on their Xbox to actually have that pinata in their garden. So a great new feature making it really easy to share pinatas. Thank you very much. No problem, thanks.